The past two months were hard, from dealing with buddy's allergic reaction, running from vet to vet, not knowing what it is or what it could be, to having multiple van breakdowns and mental breakdowns, it is finally time to leave this chapter behind and starting a new one. It's time to leave after two months and hit the road again. So the first thing I'm doing now is driving to the York Zone getting a coffee because without coffee I can't finish this whole list that I have before I'm leaving tomorrow. <laughs> go to the cool area because I have a freaking food shop. <laughs> I mean, look what I already got, like things that I will never get like a week ago. <laughs> Literally cheese, ham, like, I don't know, some fresh stuff. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like I paid 50 euros or like $60 from the, all of this. I mean, it's kind of, it's like, it's okay, but I feel like there is not really a change. I have to put it in the back because I'm literally so close to the other car. I feel like it's just not a big difference to Europe. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna pay. Look at this, my cereals. <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay, my fridge is full. This one is also completely full. And up there, it's also completely full. And I'm sweaty as hell. <laughs> Uh, it is just insane hot like my shirt is literally one with my body but do you know what like it's basically just sparkling water with some stuff inside and i used to drink it a lot when i was living in chicago because my whole family was literally just drinking it and this one is with coke i never taste it with coke but it's kind of good though <laughs> Are we leaving him? Are we leaving him? Are we leaving him? Rabanne. Rabanne. I'm leaving. I'm leaving again. <laughs> and we all see each other yeah, in yeah. like about in a, a month. In another country, probably. Huh? No, oh, not no, another country. No, 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 no. Well, who knows? <laughs> in Guatemala or in Belize? Yeah, somewhere. Of yeah. Course. It won't be but long. No, like, no, like maybe a month. A month. Two. <laughs> say goodbye, goodbye. It was nice to meet you, and we're gonna see each other again. Yeah, totally. Okay. Keep me up I will. I will. I'm not worried. <laughs> I'm not worried, but if something. You're not worried? Maybe I'm just coming for the next 10 kilometers and I have a breakdown. Who knows? <laughs> that will be my life, actually. We're gonna leave now. We're gonna leave now. Okay, guys, I'm at my van. I'm leaving now. I don't know. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous, I'm also weird. Like, I don't, I can't express my feelings right now. Okay. Okay, to be 
calm down, calm down. Hello home now, hello home. Oh, okay, I'm gonna get ready for the road. And then I'm gonna leave. <laughs> I'm just having my breakfast now. It is 10 a.m. I literally woke up at 7, fresh and good. And you know how much I miss this? To be, like, just wake up and be good and, like, feel good and, like, be full of energy. I miss it. So we're gonna have a mukbang now. I got a couple of questions about why I'm not traveling with Susie anymore and what happened if we had a fight or whatever, whatever, or whatever. Actually, she met someone and that's why I stayed there in this house as I told you in the last vlog because I said it's her lover. I mean, it was fun and everything. We had a lot of fun, but you know, it's also my adventure and that's why I decided to not wait there. And instead of that, I keep traveling now. And that's basically the answer. Um, since I'm traveling alone now, Tom, cheers to new adventures, being by myself again. And I was scared yesterday, like I don't wanna lie, I was really, really scared yesterday when I entered the van and you know, the last two times I wanted to leave, like my van had a breakdown and everything. Like I was really, really scared yesterday. Um, and I was thinking about it in the morning, like is it the right decision to leave by myself? Is it the right decision to travel by myself in a country or like in countries, which is not Europe, you know what I'm saying? So. Um, I was really scared about it, but as soon as I was driving and as soon as I woke up today, I felt like it was definitely the right decision. Um, even though sometimes it might be scary, like a decision that you don't feel 100% comfortable with. You know, sometimes you have to make a scary decision to keep going and growing and you know, just work on yourself. And I think that's what I did yesterday. I was scared the first time in my life to be by myself. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna enjoy my breakfast now and then I'm gonna head to work because obviously someone has to, f you know, be financially able to live this life. <laughs> Anyways, see you later, guys, see you later. Cheers to the good life. Okay, I want to tell you a story about this table. You know, this one here, I bought it extra for the van and it was like not really cheap to be honest. And they just had this one here with the two cups holder and I decided to get this table as well and pay like over a hundred euros extra for this freaking table. And I never used it. How about how is it on the other side of the car? <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Why well, I'm over here. <laughs> You're gonna drive now, but oh, that will be so chill. Imagine someone will drive there and I'm just like here, freaking working and just chilling. <laughs> Great, great place to be. <laughs> I hope when it's getting dark, they're gonna disappear because I need my peace. <laughs> I would say, guys. Good night, and we're gonna see each other tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>
I'm gonna drive to the gas station and stay at the gas station. It's like a huge gas station with a cafe and like Wi-Fi and all of that. It also means I have to say goodbye to the ocean because we will not see the ocean for a long time till I can finally surf again. By the way, I didn't told you the other day my window here was blowing up. Like it was like, <laughs> it was just gone in the middle of a highway. So I had to get it. And now it's completely ruined and I'm scared that I'm driving. It's gonna go off again because it's not fixed at all. Like not, like I tried to tie it up with this thingy here. Let's see if this is, uh, if, uh, I don't know. And if it rains, like literally the whole rain is coming in here. Well, okay, I lost my window again. Oh, oh my God, I'm so happy that I fixed it there. Otherwise it will blow away again, fuck. Okay, I fix it like this now and then I'm gonna do it later when we're at the gas station. Oh guys, it happened. It happened. I knew this will happen. Do you see this? Well, I guess I have no window anymore, but I made it to the gas station, so now I can figure out how I'm gonna... I don't know, how I'm gonna fix it. But I will definitely not replace it. I will not order a new thing from wherever this window comes from. I will just cover it up somehow, and I will not have a window anymore, but I'm just... It was nice to have a window, but it's time to say goodbye to it. You know, whatever. Okay, I just posted it on my Instagram and uh, someone of you said, why not installing a fan now if you have this hole there anyways? And I'm like, well, that would be actually a cool idea. I mean, those shit is quite expensive though, but I'm just gonna measure it out later on and then I'm gonna see online if I can find something and then I have to find an address where to order it to. But that would be actually a cool thing. Maybe this happened for a reason. I'm not having the money for an AC, so I can install a fan up there. Yeah, everything happens for a reason, guys. Everything happens for a reason. <laughs> okay, guys, I made it to the gas station, which is over there. And it literally feels like I'm in the movie, I don't know, area where they film movies. Because it looks like a Netflix show, huh? But like a gangster Mexican Netflix show. Anyways, I'm gonna drink my coffee now. And I'm gonna end this vlog here now. You're gonna see where I'm gonna head to. I have a plan now where I'm gonna head to because the area I'm going now, I've already been with Susie, so there's nothing much exciting. So I'm gonna drive a lot i guess so we're gonna see each other in the next video guys thank you so much for watching and yeah see you next time Adios.